Good day, fine people. A very warm welcome to you. My name is Nick on the ZX Spectrum 48K. I'm looking at a futuristic sports game, at least I think it's in the future, called Street Cred Football. You need your street cred here. Published by Players Premier in 1989. Now, it's a game for one to two players, which also come out on the Amtrad CPC and the Commodore 64. You're kicking up the pitch or down the pitch, but first we must select our players. I think it's five a side. So it's five a side football with a little bit of a slant on the thing. So away we go. Here's our players. So we can pick any of these five. I don't think it makes a great difference, but I think they're trying to build up atmosphere uh, there. So you should try and feel involved. Now, when I look at all these heads like this, it reminds me a bit of like Speedball 2, where you go onto the transfer market and try and pick those. I don't know if it's trying to be a little bit like that. Speedball 2 came out in 1990, so a year after this, but uh, the original Speedball was in 1988 uh, from uh, Imageworks, um, created by the Bitmap Brothers. So I think it might be influenced a little bit by though, that original Speedball game. We'll find out. Right, here's a computer picking his side. It doesn't matter who you pick. There's men and women there all looking a little bit angry as if they've been tripped into playing this game in the first place. If you had this game back in the day, let me know. It's not expert gameplay, it's dodgy gameplay, ninkapoop chat, and seeing was there enough there for you to want to go and play it again. No team names here. So here we go. Right, here's a... It, yes, this looks very little bit like Speedball and the Amiga, but anyway, go. I'm kicking up this time. I find this a little bit hard to control. Right, there's the ball, no sound to be uh, that I'm aware of here. And there's something that's gone wrong. There's a 128k version, maybe it's got there right. Okay, where's my goalkeeper gone? Uh, yeah, tackling is awkward. Now I'm controlling this with the keys, which probably isn't the best. They've gone one new up the red team. The red team versus the blue team, you're the blue team. Now I'm controlling this with uh, cursor keys, so it's a uh, up, down, left, right, and fire button. Uh, they're starting from the number six. Anyway, come on, up! Oh, I've got tackled. You seem to be tackled just running into people. Come on, let's get go. Here we go. Up with it, up with it, up. Uh, not expert gameplay. Now, please subscribe if you haven't already. Now, let's go and see if I can actually get a goal here. Um, I'm not enjoying this so far. A big thank you to those people who subscribed there. And as we go forward in stress busting uh, fashion. Um, now, it's not easy to create a football sort of game on the Spectrum or any 8-bit really because you don't got that much memory. There's a lot of players to control and positioning and the flight of the ball and all that sort of stuff. This isn't doing a bad job, but like most of the ones, it's not very uh, playable and I don't think the play is very fair either. Oh, come on, goal! Is that a... Yes, right, we've got a goal. 1-1, one, one. maybe I've got a chance. But you know, these games get slightly better if you get better at them. This is just a little bit dull, uh, but the... Um... They've got a few markings on the um, the pitch there, like wear and tear. They, do they repeat or are they individual? I think they're individual. So that's not bad. Um, shows that the, shows have got a bit of urban to it. But they haven't gone really kind of a cyberpunk feel that the Speedball games did. I think it's lacking there. Add a bit of beefy sound, it might be okay. I like the um, uh, the timer there, uh, the font used for that. But the gameplay isn't brilliant and that's what's uh, letting it down so it looks like it's got the basis of a good game here it's just not that interesting or fun uh, to play you want it to be a lot better than it really is and street cred football is a terrible terrible name um, speedball great name street cred not very good name but anyway it might have given you a little bit play playing this if you had it played it a lot back in the day and got good at it you might disagree with me because you're coming from a standpoint of nostalgia and that's fair enough that's fair enough is what you played back in the day made it a part of you and those memories but i'm not going big on the thing and um i think i want to play sales but then i'm trying to think of what football games there were good on the zx spectrum a lot of people like um uh, match day and match day 2 which i didn't like those either so perhaps this game wasn't built for me in mind but having said that though i did really love the speedball games on the commodore amiga so maybe it just hasn't got enough grunt uh, memory to push it but nice bit of shadowing going on there as well on the pitch and the side there Right, and I'm getting my uh, bottom handed to me on a silver platter as he's losing 5-1. If you've had your bottom handed to you on a silver platter, then comment in the comment section below. 5-1. Well, I've got a goal. It was 1-1 one, one at one point. But I'm finding tackling difficult, and I'm finding the whole advantage is with them. Looks like it's just individual games going on here rather than a league. I would have liked a league or a cup, something like that, to accompany uh, this. That would have made things a bit interesting. Right, the red team have got another goal, and it's six plays one. Six plays one. Oh man, come on, let's just keep going. Keep going. 
I mean, if you weren't here, I would have turned it off. I would have loaded something else by now. So the matches, there's no ability, I don't think, to change the match length. Maybe we could have done with that a bit shorter. Uh, maybe bribe the ref or something like that. A few power-ups on the screen might have lifted it. So it's, it's just lacking that overall little bit of um, extra playability, extra finish. So power-ups would have been very, very welcome. Uh, they were very popular in a lot of games like this. Is that going in? Yes, right, right, two. I scored two on my own low standards. It's a success. If you want to see other ZX Spectrum games we've reviewed, uh, there's a link to those in the playlist below. Or if you want to see everything, click on my username, takes you to the channel page. Click on the playlist tab, and ZX Spectrum will be there along with a list of other stuff. Uh, if you want to have a look at the Facebook page as well, the Twitter page, you can do. Bit of fun there, but uh, mainly we post links to stuff going up here. So if you want to stay here, click on the bell notification. You'll get emails when new videos go up. And they go up all the time. Yes. Yeah, did you own this one? Let me know. Let me let me know. You might have got it on a budget, maybe, or full price. At uh, 8 2, as soon as you start losing pretty heavily, uh, yes. I mean, a kid's imagination adds a lot to these games. So the different characters there uh, might have uh, gone. It doesn't, doesn't got their names below them, but when they do score, it does mention what their name is. Uh, that's a goal. That's scored by Kev. Yes, that's a good name. I'm not sure if he's wearing a crash helmet or his hairstyle has uh, got, I don't know, made out of metal maybe. If your hairstyle is made out of metal, uh, then comment in the comment section below. Does it keep you dry or does it give you neck ache? Oh, I've got own goal. Well done, Colin. We needed that. 3-9. Three 3-9. Nine. Three nine. There's no Barry here from the legendary goalkeeper from Speedball 2. Yes, yeah, so if you check the uh, live stream, it's done for a while there. We did a Speedball 2 live stream. That was pretty cool. Right. Come on. Du, 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 du. Come on, Eileen. Du, 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 du. Yeah, I'm finding defending terrible. You can change. I think you can change your formation somehow on this. But I'm finding defending very, very tricky. And also keeping possession of the ball very tricky. It's, it's demanding like a slide tackle feature, like micro pro soccer or something, where I can just slide in on their bum or kick off two and, and, and get it. But it's a little bit... It's a bit too slow, really, um, there. But I think it's going as quick as the Spectrum could possibly do. I don't think it would go a lot quicker than this. It's just, I don't, it's a nice idea. I don't think the system's really up, up to um, performing it. But as I say, you might love it. You might get a bit more out of the uh, thing. In two players, it might be a little bit more exciting. Uh, in 48K, it's ghostly quiet, uh, and that's an issue there. So um, sound always adds atmosphere. Yeah, if, you've, if you've played a particularly a good game, and uh, it's always got good, good, good sound, and that not just Spectrum. Any any system can make it. When it's a when there's no sound at all, uh, you just it's a, it's a little bit uh, flat. You lose a bit of experience, and that, I think maybe that is suffering here. It's desperate to be a speedball, cyberpunk sort of space age futuristic game. But in the end, it's just been whimpering out of something in in the background there. One of the kids that was never noticed at school, whose name you can't remember. Yes. Mm, try that. Try and get a, get a piece of paper and try and write down everyone that was in your class at secondary school. Uh, There's probably about 30 of them. See see what number you get and um, say that all the ones missing will be the quiet people that kept themselves to themselves. Which isn't a bad strategy, to be fair. As I lose, 4 plays 13. God, I just want that time to tick down now. 147. Can I, I've got four goals. That's miraculous. I mean, in a lot of these sort of games, I end up with none. Or a tennis game, I don't even manage to return the ball or volleyballs. As I say, my gameplay is not the best. It's not walkthroughs. I still get stick now, now and again. Um, it's the average game player, sometimes slightly less than average, or try and, you know, recreate that experience rather than, you know, like an AI computer playing it or some super duper expert. It's trying to be the real experience, folks. Okay, good. You know this because you've been in the channel for a long time. So thank you. A huge thank you on that measure. A shout out to the members of keeping the channel running it's always hard to try and create awareness to the channel to keep it growing and uh, it's more and more work as i say that's why the facebook and twitter channels um are there to try and create awareness to this is it helping i don't know is it killer me maybe slightly but come around with today and rescue me hooray starts off quite cheap you know but I, I won't i won't push it i mean if you're going through a bit of stress or you know you're feeling it as we all do uh, and this is creating a distraction then hooray just keep watching and i'll, I'll get joy from that the watch time boof there we go i'm not sure how many other reviews there are of this maybe a few be interested to see how it plays on the Commodore 64, actually, because that will have added sound. Might run ever so slightly quicker with a slight uh, additional memory. 
If you played it on that system, or indeed the Amstrad CPC, let us know below. Is it is it a similar experience to this? Is it better? Is it worse? What do you think? I mean, obviously there's going to be a bit more colour there going on, I would have thought. But um, yeah, might play similar, might play a lot better. All right, well, it's, it's desperate for a tackle button. You just seem to walk into them. And it seems to me that the computer can just walk through my people, and I can't do vice versa as it plays four. 15. If it was a boxing match, they would have thrown in the tower by now to stop me getting killed. But, yes, but we only view to be about 10 minutes long, just to give you an overall flow of it, because I, I might start off hating a game and end up liking it uh, there, or vice versa. But we've, I think we've seen all the play here, so we might as well play it to the end of the match, see if I can get 5, or they'll probably get 16. That's more than likely. Um, my strategy now is, from the from the kickoff bit, is, is to go straight into defence. There, but the, the ball bounces off the goal, so it's a wall. It doesn't actually physically go in. 19 seconds. Right. Can I get a goal in uh, 19 seconds? Well, the answer is probably no. Can they get a goal? The answer is probably yes. There it goes. Is it in? Look, where's my goalkeeper? He's out to lunch. Four plays 17. Well, it was close. Do you remember back early on in this video? You might have done, uh, if you're still there, to listen to this question. Well, it was 1-1. And, um, you know, oh, we... <laughs> <laughs> we had a chance possibly of winning. Right, come on. I need to study how I got those other goals before. And then I might get... Yes, is that going in? No. Oh, God. I almost got mighty five then. Uh, maybe I picked all the wrong players. They, they, all seem, they all look the same on the pitch, don't they? They all look pretty similar. And that's the end of the match. Well, four plays, 17. Convincing defeat uh, for me. But, you know, if I kept playing, I might get a bit better. Four is better than none. So it gives us something to work on. So I hope you like to have a look at that one. As I say, I thought it was a bit lacklustre. Great idea, but um, yeah, system doesn't seem to be able to deliver what it was trying to do. But uh, okay, but I wouldn't go back to it very much. It's a bit too flat. So I hope you'd like to have a look at that one. That was Street Cred Football on the ZX Spectrum 48K, published by Players Premier in 1989. Got any comments about this game, similar games, or anything retro, then please put that below. You're more than welcome. And until next time, take great care of yourself and a very fond goodbye. Goodbye. Come on, du, 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 du. come on, Eileen. Du, 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 du.